Hey, it's uh, Chris here today from Huckle Equipment. Uh, today we're going to be talking about the F2690 and how it's all set up for some snow removal here and uh, for one of the Canadian winters. So, uh, so let's jump right into it, talking about this blade out front. When talking out front, you'll see that uh, we have a 60 inch blade on the front of here uh, that angles uh, hydraulically. Uh, again, this is actually a B series blade. Uh, that's what's designed for it because it has a B series quick attach on the front. Yeah, and same quick attach what you would have saw on the B2650 and, and the predecessors to that. So, so after that, you can get snowboards for the front, either a 51 or 57 inch. Both are very popular. It really comes down to how wide you need it. Uh, again, if you're doing sidewalks, generally speaking, they're about 54 inches wide. Uh, so you're probably going to go with a 51 on that with the extensions. Whenever you just have the blade out front, you're going to have one hydraulic valve on the front. If you're going to the snowboard, you're going to need two for that hydraulic deflector as well as rotate. So, uh, so be mindful of that if you're uh, going to get it set up is what it's going to require out front. After that, you're going to be like, well, this has the same quick attach as my B2650. Why can I not put a snowblower, my snowblower on the front of that? On the front of this it's like well it is a pretty well the exact same snowblower except the gearbox is turned the exact opposite way so uh so you can't just move from one from the other f-series snowblowers fit f-series tractors uh so if you're looking at used ones or whatever be mindful of that and obviously there is quick different quick attaches throughout the years so so yeah so let's now uh, jump talk about this cab previous to this actual cab was uh what you were normally going to see in canada was a jodel perry cab uh, they're made out west and readily readily available and easy to put on. This one is actually a Curtis cab uh, made for Kubota uh, and supplied by Kubota Canada. So uh, very easy to get now and you can finance it with the machine. So it is uh, gaining popularity and it is a nice cab. There's no doubt about it. So uh, it's nice and metal. Uh, you know, you got your sliding windows. Uh, big thing in winter, obviously you got your heater down here, a nice basic one. Uh, you'll see some inlets up top uh, and it has LED lights, uh, you know, front and rear uh, work lights on that that are L standard LED. After that, you're going to have an uh, extra fan inside uh, to really push around that air so that uh, you don't get any fogging or anything like that whenever you're dealing with moisture and in colder temperatures, uh, you definitely don't want it fogging up on you. Uh, you know, it comes standard with a front work, uh, front wiper as well. So it is a nice cab, a little bit expensive, but uh, what's not these days, uh, it does do what it's supposed to do and that's keep you out of the weather and keep you nice and comfortable in there. There is quite a bit of room in there. Uh, the F-Series does have that going for it. Uh, the one downside obviously with any add-on cab is noise. Uh, you'll hear it echoing as I'm talking. It is loud in there uh, whenever you're operating it, but that's standard for any add-on cab. So, so yeah, so that's kind of uh, the end of that, uh, talking about the cab. And then after that uh, is the operator station itself. Uh, in the F-Series is quite comfortable. It's got that same uh, standard seat you're gonna see on like a B26. Uh, so very comfortable uh, seat on that way with the suspension seat. Uh, you know, it comes with a two range hydrostatic transmission, 26 horsepower. Uh, it is a nice basic unit to get uh, that power to the front and get that snow out of the way. So, so yeah, so that kind of brings a little bit of the, that brings the end of the spiel about this cab. Uh, so that brings us to the end of today's video of giving a quick overview of what's available for these F-Series, uh, whether it be the cabs, blowers, or blades out front. So if you did enjoy today's video, please like and subscribe. And if you have any comments, please leave them down below. Thank you.